starting the clothing line is not as hard as it used to be. You might think you need a factory, you might think you need a million dollar investment. Some of the most successful clothing lines, bro, started off as just an idea. People who didn't have much just had an idea and a dream. The CEO of one of the most lit clothing brands out right now, talking about Payola. The man who started this company, bro, is from my city. He had a strategy, he had his ideas, persisted, he stayed down with it. He's literally turned it into a successful brand. So today, I wanna talk about how you could do the exact same and how you can do it with zero dollars to start. I know that's hard to believe, but if you follow along to the end, you will definitely see that that's 100% possible. Right, so I'ma lay it out for you step by step, right? First thing you need is a game plan, right? You need to know how you're gonna attack this. You need to know if you're gonna do shirts, if you're gonna do full body stuff. You need to know if you're targeting men, women. I'ma go ahead and give you some game by telling you that you could, you will probably benefit by doing both but it is no secret that today women are the number one buyers of anything online of online shopping period now since i'm telling you how to do this without no money to start kind of we kind of have to do it a little differently than the typical startup model right i want to introduce you to a concept called drop shipping if you're not already aware of it where you charge for a product get the money for a product and place an order with your supplier then that supplier sends the product to your customer. That's drop shipping at its most simple form. Keep that in your back pocket. Now, there's also suppliers. Now, since you're aware how that business model works, suppliers that'll take a design that you have, print it on a mug, print it on a hoodie, print it on a backpack, this on a shirt. This and drop shipping need, but ride along here because there's a lot more to it. Very first thing you're gonna need, of course, a logo. Keep in mind, bro, I'm gonna give you some sauce. As a graphic designer myself, that the best logos in the entire world are very simple, right? A lot of people overdo their logo, overdo their branding. Do not overdo it, bro. Look, see Nike, it's a check. Nike, just do it. We ultimately want our brand to be number one. Talking zero dollars, right? So if you don't want to pay a graphic designer, you can go on somewhere like Canva and create a simple logo and get going from there. After you have your logo done, now what you need ultimately is a good starter design, right? Now, once again, have zero dollars, so we can't go we can't go get a design. And honestly, I'm gonna be real with you about the whole process, right? Not being able to get a good design is gonna hurt drastically because you have a good design, then you can sell more merchandise than you could ever even imagine. It's not over for us yet because ultimately how hard you're willing to go how hard you're willing to work around these problems is ultimately how ultimately how far you'll go in succeeding so with that said there's free design software out there you got old faithful microsoft paint and if you don't have microsoft paint you don't have a windows you're a mac guy like me several sites like canva vector software like that if you can't figure out how to use them go to youtube and type to make a t-shirt design on canva you have your designs once you have everything like that make sure you save them off as jpegs and pngs because you're going to need it for another step All right now let's talk about the print on demand the business side of this right this is the good part this is how this is all able to work with zero dollars so make sure you pay attention the main print on demand businesses that i trust that i know of are going to be teespring Printable and Printify. There's some things to consider when you're picking amongst those three. And if you need to, go ahead and sign up for a free account on all of them so you can move around and see exactly what I'm talking about. So on most of these platforms, first you pick your item. So mostly item, and let's say that's just a base t-shirt, right? Keep in mind, like I said, on most of these platforms, can, you're, you're gonna have to pick your product because you could print on mugs, hoodies, anything, right? But we're gonna use a base t-shirt as the example. After you've selected that, now it's time to check out the prices, right? This is the most important part for you because usually there's going to be a host of different printers right that print this same t-shirt printed in different variations so they might print that t-shirt in red white blue black or whatever one might charge you seven dollars per shirt one might charge you twelve dollars per shirt one might charge you seven dollars one might charge you ten dollars in free shipping one might charge you honestly five dollars five dollars shipping you pretty much just have to decide what makes sense for you as far as the production time right that's how because the printers are going to tell you hey we, once we get your order, we print this shirt in under two business days, right? So you want to take into account production time. You want to take into account, of course, the price because ultimately it's going to be going to be it's your profit margin that you're talking about. So if it costs you seventeen dollars in total for this shirt, then you know you need to be charging somewhere around twenty nine to even be five dollars per shirt. Now, now, remember in the earlier module, I told you, hey, you need to save those images when you make your designs, right? Because now. What it's time to do when you're on these type of services is you're going to upload your design because what they're going to do for you is create something called mock-ups 
your shirt, right? This is where you can go on your site, wherever you're selling, which we will cover in the next module. And you can showcase your shirt, which moves us right into how we're going to sell, right? Most of the time, what happens is, is you, these, all these sites, I learned about them, Shopify. Usually you just connect your Shopify website to it and the entire process is actually automated, right? So I would get an order on my Shopify store. It was connected to was connected to Printful or Printify, so they would directly get the order, and it was just really seamless for me. If we can't spend any money, then we would we would need to use platforms like Big Cartel, like Wix, to kind of build our online store, right? Because we have to set these up somewhere. We have to sell them, right? We have to have a platform. So I would use Big Cartel or Wix. They allow you to pretty much build online stores and charge for things, right? Because they allow us to build online stores and charge for things brings me which brings me to my next point social media advertising is gonna have to be the way that you start to get traffic to wherever you're gonna get wherever we're gonna sell these shirts because can't put any we're starting with zero dollars right so we can't put any money to advertising can't put we can't put much money into advertising we can't put we can't for shout outs or anything like that so this is gonna have to be all the way organic however if at this point you followed along to every step of this video and you already have and know what it takes start a clothing brand with zero dollars now keep in mind bro if you got a little money to throw into your business do it because ultimately that's how that's how you're gonna get a return from it it will make this process just so much easier for you for all the ways that I'm in. Whether it's getting a good design, whether it's paying for promo, whether it's building, getting a really good online store built. Absolutely not easy, but building a clothing brand 100% from scratch, 100% realistic. Like I said, that's Payola Bam, man. He started it from nothing. This business, from my perspective, kind of grew word from mouth. I mean, you started seeing it everywhere. All the, you know, all the most important people in the city start wearing it. And so outside of the fact that it's quality and it's 100% dope, I just want to show y'all real life people bro who chasing their dreams and doing it and i want y'all to do the same so man go gang love y'all man we out